Welcome back to the Cooler Denim channel. I'm Tina and today I am coming to you with a makeup tutorial. Right now I'm just applying my concealer and I think my color inspiration is going to be yellow, bold yellow. You know, I get a lot of questions about my makeup. People always want to know what type of makeup I use. What do I clean my face with? And to be honest, I just use plain soap and water. Um, less is more for me. Um, it doesn't take a lot. I find that when I use products on my face, a lot of cleaning products, they actually break my skin out. My skin does better with just natural soap and water. So that's what I stick to. And as far as the soap, I use Dove Moisturizing Soap for my skin, the Cocoa Butter Formula. And right now I am just applying my concealer underneath my eyes to cover any bags that I may have under my eyes because I stay up late working and watching movies. I'm going in with a brown, a dark brown liner to line my lips now. This makes my lip color stay on a lot longer. And as far as the type of makeup I use, right now I'm using the Born to Glow, which you can find at your local drugstore beauty supply house. And for my eye color, I think I want to go bold today with this beautiful yellow. Isn't that cute? Yes, we're going to do yellow on my eyes and my lips, actually. So y'all stay tuned and let's see how this turns out. I'm going to start first by prepping my eyes with a white um, pencil so that my yellow actually pops more. I just applied the white pencil over my eyelid up into the crease area. And then once I finished that, I started with my yellow palette. And because I have individual eyelashes on and I can't remove them, I make sure that I just hold my eyelashes down when I'm applying my color so that I'm not getting a lot of um, eyeshadow residue on my lashes. And then if I need to clean them, I find that a wet Q-tip works really good for getting any um, residue off of your actual lashes you see that yellow is really popping i'm loving it so far and of course i'm cleaning my brush with my brush cleaner that i got for 99 cents at the mall and it works wonders i love it I apologize that I'm not getting um, for the video not showing my full face but I thought it was capturing it but once I finished recording and I went back and looked at it I noticed that it was cutting off the top part of my face but but y'all get the picture I'm new to this so hey work with me now I'm going in with a little lime green just to complement that bold yellow, um, I'm going to go in with the lime green on my outer corners of my eye and in the crease area. Now I'm going to go in with this darker green color. I'm going to be applying this to my crease area. Just to give my eyes a little contrast. I think I look better with um, 
a little darker shade in my crease. The yellow was cute, but I think the green is gonna make the yellow pop even more. And don't be afraid to go back in and add more color um, as needed. I decided to start doing these makeup tutorials because a lot of my dark skin clients, because I am a professional licensed hairstylist, and a lot of my clients always used to say that they wish they could wear colors like I do. And they can. You just have to know what complements your skin tone. And remember to wear the color. Don't let the color wear you. And it's the eyes for me. Today anyways. I think I'm also going to go for yellow on my lips too. Just because I'm a little extra. So y'all just see how this turns out. As I mentioned earlier, I'm using the Born to Glow Foundation and Cappuccino. And I don't use a lot of foundation because I really don't need it. So less is more, like I stated earlier. You don't have to pile on foundation just because. It use what you need for your skin type. Please, whatever you do, be sure to cover your neck if you're yeah. so that it matches your face. I hate to see a light face in a dark neck. <laughs> don't do it, please don't do it. And right now, I am just blending my makeup in, and you want to make sure that you blend good. So, blend. Blend, blend. Yes, I'm using my favorite navy blue eyeliner to line my lids with. Um, I do not like to use black to line my lids. I think it gives me raccoon eyes. Plus, I think the navy blue makes the dark brown eyes stand out more. So blue um, is my go-to color for lining my eyes. Sometimes I use a lighter blue, but today I'm using with the navy blue. I'm now lining my top lid with a black liquid liner. Holding down my individual eyelashes. This helps to remove or cover any fallout that may have got on my individual eyelashes during the eyeshadow application.
I'm going to highlight my cheekbone area today using this dark burnt orange color. I think it complements my skin tone really well and it's not too pink rosy color. It kind of just blends in with my skin tone, so I love this color. When I first started wearing makeup, I hated blush. I thought that um, dark people could not wear blush. I, I didn't know what color to choose. I didn't even know where to start. But I just started experimenting and voila, I found a color that I actually liked. It doesn't make me look like a clown. Now I'm gonna use some shimmer just to um, highlight my top of my cheekbone area and my nose. This really gives you a nice glow and I really like it. And I believe um, this shimmer is by um, MAC, if I'm not mistaken, yes. And a little will take you a long way but it does make a difference and it does make your look stand out even more. We are just about done. Only thing left basically is the yellow lip color, which I am too excited to try. So let's keep it moving. love this color and I actually created this color myself when I had my own little lip gloss line. It was, this is one of the colors that I created and I'm telling you it is popping honey. So last but not least, let's take this bonnet off so we can get this look all the way together for you guys. And I am rocking deep wave and loose wave hair. I'm just fluffing it out with my fingers. I don't use a comb or a brush or any product on the hair, only my fingers for everybody that's been asking me about this hair. If you don't know, then you know, you know. this time to thank everybody that has subscribed to my channel liked a video or showed me any type of love thank you guys i'm up to 15,000 views be sure to like share and subscribe to the cooler denim channel because what we're cooler denim and be sure to also hit the notification bell so that you are notified when i upload a new video and here is my finished look Yes, honey, that yellow is saying something. Dark skin can't wear bold colors. <laughs> Guess they lied. Because I wear the color, the color don't wear me. Get it?